Hello everybody, this is Promethean Gamer here, and I'm here to show you what kind of build you'd want to do for a double ganger in the pre-sequel. So anyway, uh, obviously the, if I'm correct, the first tree I went with was this one right here. And I spent, I went with best foot forward. Uh, my dura it obviously increases your duration, so that's a really good thing to have because it, you know, it's based on your kills. Uh, so when you get really high, then you can increase your duration, and it's very long. Um, bolster increases the max health of you and your jacks, and obviously it's a kind of an okay bonus, but you know it's better than nothing. So I just went with these two. Next, I went with the uh, shield because I want to keep them. You want to keep them alive longer. Uh, also, I went with this, and I've also got five points for my class mod. Uh, I've also got Jack's Cache, uh, where I can throw a grenade, and I can also throw a free grenade. I also went with this one, uh, where I could have my uh, Jack's throw their own grenades. I went four on this, there's not a lot, and it also does bring down your shield recharge delay. I just put those points there so I can unlock these next ones. I went with this one all the way. Uh, regenerates up to 22% of my max health per second and my shield capacity is up 88%. But as you can see, I've also got 6 skill points for my class mod. And then I went with the ability to promote my Jax ranks. And then I just put this there because I like hearing Jack's voice. Uh, next, I went with this one. I didn't go all the way down. Uh, I didn't see a point to go any further. But anyway, my first one was the weapon swap speed. I don't want to be wasting time between my swapping weapons. Um, then I went with this one where I could, you know, reload my all equipped weapons by throwing a grenade. And this works with this very well because, you know... I can throw a free grenade and it not reload, but I don't have to worry about losing any grenades. Then there's DigiJax, and that also has a chance of reloading. And then after that, I went with this where I can do that. And I know it's kind of hard to do, but it's, you know, that one thing the I didn't want to go with either of these. Um, really... I don't really care about my fire rate, really. I really don't. Usually the fire rate is good. I hardly ever use any slow weapons. The slowest weapons I use are maybe Jacob's. But that's about it. Uh, I didn't do compound interest, mostly because I really don't care. And then I went with the override skill, so I can do damage to my enemies without uh, using any ammo for my guns. And it's actually a pretty good skill. And then I went with this tree, and the first thing I've done is that whenever a Digijack dies, you gain a stack collaborate. And uh, with the way this game is set up, you can move very quickly, and each Jack can die, and you can gain those stacks much, much faster. I also went with teamwork, where I, if I ally enters fight for your life or a jack dies, I regenerate health. Uh, I know it's not that big, but um, I really don't care. These aren't that big of a bonus. That's eight percent, and that's only six percent. Uh, then I went with the wrist laser, so my digi jacks can do more damage. Uh, I went with this. Just to move on to this next one. I also went with this one because it helps whenever I need to do damage to any nearby enemies quickly. That's a good way to do it. Um, I also went with this. I know it's not those not big percentages, but uh, when you ha but look it, when you get to 50 stacks, you know you got 50 percent fire rate and the plus 100% reload speed so you know if you can get up to those 50 stacks that's actually pretty good I then went to this one 
where I can have a sp shock nova with my digi jacks, and then I put a point there. I'm trying to get this one here. So um, anyway, I want to show you what my jacks are like. I'm on uh, playthrough three. I'm only level sixty-four. So. Uh, As you can see, the wrist lasers are actually really good at taking down shields. trying to get to level 72. Uh, hopefully I can make another video show it off again. I'll also be doing Let's Plays. I'll be doing it on a doppelganger. Hopefully that'll be up soon. Uh, so I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye!